please prepare for a moment of silence. Thank you. The Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hi, Hi chieftains. chieftains. It's Jordan. And Noah. With your junior high news. The Spring Choir Concert and Senior Night will be held Thursday, April 27, at 7 p.m. The program will include a great collection of 80s pop tunes presented by our junior high and senior high choirs. Please join us for a great concert. We have some more state champions. The varsity stunt team went an amazing 11-0 on their season to win the eight-man stunt state championship last Thursday at OBU. We could not be more proud of Coach Hurst and her team on this amazing accomplishment. Also, cheerleading tryouts are coming up. Clinic Thursday, April 20th, 3.30 through 5. Tryouts Friday, April 20th at 4 p.m. Tryout packets are available in the front offices. Our baseball team takes to the diamond tomorrow night at Muskogee. The SJH soccer teams take the field tonight versus Carver at the SHS Westside Soccer Complex. Chieftains travel to McAllister at the end of the week. It's a busy week for our junior high tennis team. The Lone Wolf Tournament is today, and the team will be on the court again on Thursday at the Junior High OTCA Tournament. Tulsa 7 Tournament Results Edie Chapman got one singles champion, Rainy Tucker with a two singles runner-up, and girls finished third as a team. Henrietta Tournament Results Edie Chapman, one singles third, Rainy Tucker, two singles third, and girls finished third as a team. Also, Edie Chapman got her 50th career match win at the Henrietta Tournament. Way to go, Edie. The NCAA Eligibility Center is also hosting a webinar for college-bound student-athletes and their families on Sunday, April 30th. High school student-athletes focused on playing this sport at the NCAA level won't want to miss this informative hour with the Eligibility Center staff. Learn about the next steps based on your year in high school and how the removal of standardized test score requirements may impact your eligibility experience. Parents, families, or advocates are encouraged to join. Have a, Have a great, great week, week, Chieftains. Chieftains.